Hey guys, it's Icen here, and I am back with some more Better Than Wolves. Um, I finally sucked it up and made a bunch of nether coal, so more torches and such. And I'm trying to decide what to do. I have 20 obsidian on me, and I'm debating between... Okay, let's put that back. My mouse is being real awkward today. And right now, basically, I'm debating between... You know what, let's just go out a bit more and put another portal. Uh, because my other thought was going back to that mine and exploring it some more. But let's just pop out some more portals, see what we can do there first. I'm just going to head this way, roughly 200. Okay. See what we can find here. Uh, I'm still in a pretty... I was about to say, I was still in a pretty hidden cave here, but not so much. Okay, cool. We're safe. So we're going to head out this way about, yeah, as I said, around 200 or so odd blocks and see what we can find. Um, still, I really should have brought my... I was planning on doing the whole mining thing to... Not, uh, the going to the abandoned mine shaft and dealing with that. And then I kind of changed my plans as I got out here. I was planning on doing that and then dealing with... um doing the portal stuff as I got back home. And I realized that, yeah, I left all my fire resistance potions in the chest near my portal. Uh, I also need to bring this up to bright. I apologize. I need to remember to do that when I go into the nether because I know that it gets really, really dark recorded. So I will try my best to remember that a bit more. Where, how far out are we? We're like... Eh. This is how I do it. This is how I figure out how far out I am. Roughly. Not quite 200. Now, it's not exactly accurate, you know, because I have to make slopes, so... Whoops. It's because I have to make slopes and such not, but it gives me a rough idea, at least. Okay, cool. Cool. So we're going to continue on this way. Do I want to be up here? Kind of leaning towards no, I don't want to be up here. We're just going to go peek real quick. God, the nether's so bad looking. Ugh. If I had to pick one major frustration with Minecraft, it'd be just the nether in general. It's so monotonous looking, it bothers me. But whatever. It's just here to be exploited. Screw the denizens of the nether. They need to learn to live in a real place anyway. You know what? We could probably just make a portal here above my set. Yeah, let's do that. We're going to come up here and make one. Since we have a nice flat area, um, it seems pretty protected from ghasts. So, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, there we go. And, uh, let's hope we get something good here. Where did I take damage? Oh, yeah, I fell. <laughs> Holy shit. This is a scary ass spawn. Oh, my God. Okay. Not exactly the type of spawn I was expecting. But all in all, pretty cool to essentially have the makings of a, um, nice, more redstone. I saw a bit of gold up there. I'm just not sure if I want to go for, ooh, diamonds. Okay, so let's get my redstone first. Um, I'm wondering if my, the portal here took out one of the chests. Gunpowder, bread, ancient manuscript, string... Nice. We want to keep this here. So we make sure this is all well lit up. But we definitely want that there so that um, we can make a mossy cobble sp f uh, farm. And what I want to do is get that gold and them diamonds. So this was a very interesting spot to spawn at, I must say. Rather excited about it. 
Okay, so let's get my gold. Cool. Ow. And I'm thinking I should just go through this wall here. Oh my god. This takes a while to mine, even with a diamond pick. So we're just gonna go through here, get these diamonds. I mean, we should poke up to the surface and see what's going on. Basically, just dig up to the surface. I'm not gonna do anything crazy. Okay. Let's make sure there's actually land below me. And I definitely want that there. Please, shift key, don't fail me now. I always get so nervous when I'm holding shift. Because I've had way too many instances of my shift key just utterly failing me. There we go. I'm just going to poke around a little more. Only two diamonds. You know what? I can't complain. I just popped down a random portal and found both diamonds, a little bit of gold, some redstone, and a easily, easily defended, um, what's it called? Thing. Uh, dungeon. I'm not allowed to complain. Okay, cool. I can get this redstone, too. For some reason, I thought that was a little lower. Okay, cool. That was nice. So what we're going to do is come back here and start working our way up and see what kind of biome we can pop out in. Uh, I want to leave that cobble there. I hear water above me, too. Okay. I'm just going to staircase up here. Whoa, okay. I heard water, so I kind of should have expected this, but I definitely didn't expect this. Uh, I just want to make sure it hasn't knocked out important torches. We're looking good. Um, There we go. Get out of here, water. How do I want to deal with this? Do I want to knock this water out, or... Oh, wait, that's actually pretty far. We're just going to take a peek. Well, this is terrifying. More gold, though. So, no complaints there. I really should have shears on me, but I totally forgot to pack them. So, let's get this gold. Gold. Excellent. Um, I'm not going to bother with the iron right now. I do think I want to go back and just start digging up at a different location. There we go. I just don't want to deal with that situation. So let's start up through this dirt. Okay. Ow! Okay, so something is allowing things to spawn here. Since we're out of the nether... Ooh, whoa, wrong one. Yeah, let's get this back to... Moody, so we can actually see how things look. Um... Okay, that's looking a lot better. Cool. So up we go. I'm getting kind of peckish. So if we can actually make it all the way to the surface from this, which would be amazing, of course. Okay, cool. I was about to say, cool, some dirt. Nice, fast digging. Where are they spawning? Okay, that should do it. I just really don't want, you know, a steady stream of zombies pouring into my nether portal. That would be essentially the worst thing ever. Okay, um... Cool. Let's see... Sweet, more dirt. Dirt just makes for really easy digging. I like it. Uh, 
Best torch placement ever. The thing I really don't want to happen is to break into another cave. Are you serious? Like this game is trolling me. Also, I'm like the worst at placing blocks. At least it was an easily secured cave, so I can't complain too much. Let's continue our upward quest. Here we go. I love the timing on that, though. I really don't want to break into another kit. Mm. Okay, we're up to top level strata. I also have no idea what time it is. I need to stop doing that. Going into the nether with absolute... I need to make a... Well. I guess I got an idea of what kind of biome it is. Um... Okay. And it seems to be night as well. Of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? Um, hmm. Ow. Okay, so I'm going to pop back down here. Make sure everything still looks all right, torch-wise. No, it doesn't. This looks dangerous. Oops. There we go. And this looks very dangerous. Is that water going to stop? Okay, cool. It's stopping. Cool. Okay, guys. What I'm going to do is... Let's see. We'll probably just, like, build some kind of containment system for the water. So we can, like, build a channel... It'll fall down so we can at least see when it turns day again. God, I'm using so much hunger doing this. I brought... Ooh, I didn't bring as many ham and eggs as I thought. Mm, I'm not the brightest, man. So what we're going to do is just dig over this way. Dig down one, and then we'll dig up. Uh, of course, we did it in that order. Cool. What? I'm just screwing up everything at this point. Okay. So there's that gone. There's that. Oh, sand fell in my hole. Okay. I couldn't figure out why it wasn't, like, staying up. <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do is chill here, um, pause the recording until we get daytime, and then I will be back. I just saw that squid. He scared me. Be back soon, guys. And we're back. I dug myself a hole up, like through a little path thing, and I came out here, which um, is interesting. I'm wondering how, like, if this is one of the ones I've already explored, because it's another jungle slash... Swamp combo. Uh, where's my torch? Okay. But we're going to poke around a little. Ooh, there's a desert as well. You know, this might be, like, just the other side of where I popped out last time. Ooh. Free pork. So what I'm going to do is head over towards this desert and then circle around in that... Circle around that jungle, see what I can see. As I said, it is quite possible that... I'm just going to end up very, very close to where I was before. That's a weird one. Um, But finding either kind of temple would be amazing. Because um, I don't, as I said before, I don't really know anything about the temples. Come get over here. So it'd be cool to explore them. You know, plus whatever loot happens to be in them. Also, it'd be nice to know how far, how close... Yep, I've been here before. Ah, this is the jungle I've already explored. Hmm. A little frustrating, but whatever. Whatever, we'll, we'll be fine. 
We just kind of popped off more on the other side of it. Um, I say we just cut straight through this jungle. Because, uh, I didn't explore the jungle extensively. So it is, it is possible that I have missed a temple. These little things are sneaky. I love these little areas in jungles. It's the only thing I like about the jungles. I, uh, when I used to play vanilla, I had a habit of making houses in areas like this. Um, so let's see what we can find. Ah, the beauty of an axe. Screw you, jungle. I don't need your crappy terrain. Hmm. I'm expecting to get, like, jumped by spiders at any time. Which is pretty scary. And we're not doing the most diligent type of exploration. At some point, I need to start working on collecting ender pearls. So I can work towards the end. But that is a bit down the line for now. And now I just kind of want to get through this jungle because I don't think I did before. Screw you, tree. I refuse to change my course for you. Keeping a nice, solid, straight path through this will make it pretty easy to find my way back, at least. Diamond axe. You're the best. Okay, so that used, like, a million hunger, roughly. Um, The nice thing is I have enough to cook up the food I have with me if I need to. Ocelot, and I still don't... Huh, there's a tree I climbed. I still don't have any fish, sadly. So we'll just have to do that. We'll have to deal with that later. Now, is this another jungle I've checked out? This whole jungle-desert combos are just like... They're killing me. They're, It's like they're slapping me in the face. Like, here's the two places you could find a temple. Fuck you, you get none. Wait, what's that? Is that just a tree? I really hope I'm not getting excited over nothing. I think it's just a tree. But part of me can't help but get really excited because that might possibly be a temple. I mean, the thing is with the jungle temple, even if it's abandoned, I at least get the pistons out of it, which are cool. Um, with a desert temple, if it's abandoned, it's not going to be nearly as nice. Finding a desert temple that isn't abandoned would be amazing, though, because of all that gold. Plus whatever new changes have been made to them. Yeah, it was just a tree. Darn. I'm not going to lie, I was a little excited. I was, got my hopes up. Though I don't think I've been through this jungle. It's, it's hard to say because it's a freaking jungle and it all looks the same. But it feels like I haven't been here. I don't see any like signs of wanton destruction. Which make me feel like I have not yet been through here. I should have packed two axes. I'll have to remember to do that in further explor exploration episodes. What the pack multiple diamond axes. Um, the thing I hate about jungles is I always feel like there's a temple just right around the corner, but it's just so dense you just can't, you just don't find it. Um, these caves are pretty cool here, though. I hear a spider. Where's he at? I'd like to get to the top of that mountain over there. And then see if I can look back at this jungle and see if I see a temple anywhere. That would be ideal. Chopping through both the durability on my axe and my hunger at a reasonable level. I knew you were around here, you little jerk. Let's kill this cow. 
There we go. You're delicious. And we'll waste a bit more hunger getting up here. Wow, that food poisoning lasts forever. It's a really cool mountain. Pretty soon I'm not going to be able to jump. There it is. Hmm. It's a really cool landscape. Probably need to spend the night here. But I think I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here, guys. Um, we're probably going to have a couple ex episodes of exploration. We'll continue exploring through this jungle. Um, yeah, I want to thank you all for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and as always, have a great day.